The supermarket shelves are already full of the Christmas classic, the humble mince pie. Well, the Consumer Guide, which have rated Marks and Spencer's mince pies the best this year, but not ones to miss out. We thought we'd also uh, decipher which ones are a festive must-have and which ones are definitely a no-ho-ho. -ho. Oh. <laughs> um, right, so Phil and, uh, and Alice have already tasted yep. them. Yeah. So we'll, we'll get what you think afterwards. Yep. Yes. Uh, your professional opinions. Absolutely. Um, and, we, uh, we've got five varieties right, here okay. to test. So, so... so so you're starting start with start number five, end. by the way. Five. Five. Start one. with number one, work your way down. <laughs> These are all different I like costs. to mix it up a bit. Oh, We're yeah. looking for, I'm going to let you taste them all, and then, I hope you're hungry. Mm. We're looking for appearance, mm. uh, pastry appearance. quality. Don't like give me any marks yet, though. Uh, oh. We're looking for the filling to pastry ratio. Yes, try them all first, because then it's easier for you to compare and contrast. And a little bit of flavour as well, because we thought there were some really contrasting flavours here. Mm. Obviously, smell. smell as well. Yes, mm. one of them's definitely got a little bit of alcohol in it, hasn't mm. it? Boozy, a bit yeah. boozy, yeah. Definitely. We've hidden a chilli in one of them, yeah. too. Mm. No, no, we, we haven't. really haven't. Don't we really that. haven't. <laughs> you taking notes? No, I just think... No, not yet, not but yet. I'm going to wait for you to eat your way through five. Do you, do you want some water? There's some water <laughs> there. There's some water there. <laughs> a dry old thing. <laughs> nice. <laughs> See, some have got... <laughs> some have got icing sugar, some have got caster sugar. I'm helping her out by glossing over You're that. very good at it. You're very good at it. <laughs> mm -mm. You like a mince pie, don't you? Mm, they're my favourite. Mince pie and birthday cake. Yeah, what do you look for? What? What do you look for in a mince pie? What, what makes it good for you? Just the most number in a box. <laughs> Mr. you're honest. <laughs> okay. right. um, so these are from all different oh, supermarkets. Sorry. Um, some are... I mean, they all range oh, between... They're about, really different. I didn't realise that. £1.80 okay, to £2.50. £2. So, are you going to come back to the front again? <laughs> yeah. OK, right, so right. the first one, number one. Can I have marks out of... 10, please, for appearance. Oh. Oh, no, you no want for, the just, oh, no, right, for the whole thing. Oh, right, for the whole thing. You're going to give me a whole yeah, thing? Yeah, yeah, okay. whole I'm giving thing. that a nine. Are you? Are Overall, you? so appearance, pastry, filling to pastry ratio and flavour. Yeah. Flavour, lovely. I love the texture. like the little bit of sugar on the top, but I don't know whether that's necessarily traditional or right, but I didn't think there was enough filling in it. I think it, it was, there was a gap at the top, yep. so I'm giving that a six. OK. Six. six. Oh, I, lo I love, really okay. like the flavour right, of it. So I'll, just give, I'll just give you my idea. I, I thought it was a dry pastry, a bit too thick, nice filling, and the flavour had a nice filling as well, but the pastry was a bit too thick for me, and they were a little bit devoid of fruit. OK, and I thought they this... Are from... They are from... Oh, sorry, of course. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Two pounds. Go. I like those. Which yep. I really them like those. 59%. Yep. So, oh. number two, what Next do you reckon? Off. I thought the pastry was really crumbly yep. and nice and thin, which was really mm. nice. I yep. thought it had a good filling. Now I get the idea of the game. I'll say a bit <laughs> more. <Okay>. Um, <laughs> I'm giving that a seven. A seven? <laughs> oh, OK. <laughs> yeah. I, um, yeah, all f I agree with Holly, yep. but for me, I thought it was a, a little bit sweet. Uh, so mm. I'm going to give this, um, uh, but because of that, I'm going to give it a five. I think Ooh, can, I, can I guess? I posh. think those are Marks and Spencers. <gasps> well, and also they've got about quite a posh gold bottom on the book as well. Oh. So that's what you pay for, bear in mind. I think they had a nice smell, nice full pastry. The pastry was soft, yep. which I quite like. Nice colour. But the only thing about the pastry was slightly cloying. Mm. I like slightly that. Slightly cloying. And that see. came from... That was my favourite. M&S. Mm. M&S? How did you know that? Yeah, I just know these. I've had five weird. boxes already. She has. I've tried a few. <laughs> I know them well. And right, this one, home. Come on. I thought it had a weird smell. Oh. Really? I wasn't keen on this. I thought it had a bit of a weird smell and I thought the pastry was like a bit oh. soggy and a bit thick. It mm. smells a bit alcoholic, doesn't it? On your lip. A bit thick. And so I didn't really like that very much. So I'm going to give that one a four. Four? Very okay. interesting. Mr Schofield? Uh, the same sort of thing. It's got a sort of almost like a fatty, fatty smell. So I'm going to give oh. that. I'm giving that a five. What interesting. I put. Um, I put. Uh, smells oily, which is mm. quite interesting. Pastry was again too thick, but the top was crisp. The full filling was quite nice, but it had a, 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 a sort of an aftertaste to it, which I couldn't I understand. Like that one at all. Uh, Where's that this one, one is. Spa. 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 And that's one that's done really well elsewhere. Two pounds and yep. which scored them 67%. Yeah. Wow, no, so, yeah. No, no, no. Next one. Oh, right, I... next one. I thought this tasted like a fig roll and not a mince pie. Yeah. I'm giving that a one. <gasps> oh! Oof. Man, that's Gosh, harsh. that's harsh. <laughs> really harsh. Oh, I don't know too. who they are, but don't go into shop, that's <laughs> for sure. <laughs> they don't taste like a mince pie. It's got to taste like a mince pie. It can't taste like a fig roll. You're a bit cheated oh, as well. I it absolutely cover it. agree with Holly. Uh, I'm not going to be quite so harsh because I do quite like the pastry, uh, but it is just raisiny. It's just lots and lots oh. of raisins. So I'm going to give that a three. It's very interesting. I put smells cheap. 
I don't like the tartlet look, it doesn't look full. The filling was, I think the filling, the actual fruit filling, was the best tasting of the whole lot. Really? Yeah. Um, but, what? but it did have an aftertaste to it, which I couldn't put my It's not the best tasting fruit. Was. It's and, not mince pie fruit. And they came from. Ta da! Morrison's. Morrison's. There you go. Where this you one's got a bit of booze in it, I think. Yes. There's possibly a bit of booze. Yeah, um, rather lovely, that I one. like the ratio of, uh, of fruit to pastry. They I look love homemade. the taste. It's very Christmassy flavour on the filling. And so this one is my winner at eight. I'm oh, going to give that wow. an eight, too, because really? it was almost as good as the Tesco's one. I like, I quite like, we had this argument beforehand. Yeah. I quite like quite. Not cheap tasting stuff, but I quite like just basic y, basic -y mince yeah. pie with no fluff and stuff. I can understand. That's that. why I like the Tesco's one. But. Yep. These, I think, look more homemade. They probably taste a little bit posher. Well, I put here, nice crunchy pastry, nice flavour. Um, my favourite, the best of all. Ooh, oh. yeah, my best of all as well. Do you want to okay. reveal where they're from? I'm going to reveal this is from... I oh. And they are the go. cheapest mince pies well, as yeah. well. So should we wow. run through the results? So your winner was the Iceland mince pie, £1.89. Wow. Then second came your Tesco Finest at £2. <coughs> then came the M&S, which was my winner, and that came top in the witch poll, and that got 12 points. Then we had the Spa mince pie at £2. And Morrison's, I'm really sorry, it just wasn't to our no. taste with £4. So, But the price difference wasn't much, and it's a very personal, very subjective taste, I mm. think.